Hi, Simon here at Landmark Trading. Now, today we're just going to talk a little bit about the uh, Cobra bracing system. So measure roughly one metre from the end of your rope, open up your rope and insert the expanding band into the rope and feed gently opening up the, the rope, feed the expanding band into the rope. So, once you've fed your expanding band into your rope, you should end up with that. This then is placed around the tree. First of all, we measure out and cut the appropriate length of anti-abrasion cover. This stops abrasion and obviously damage to the, to the tree. That should slide nicely over the length of your expanding band, which should end up with that. For the purposes of this exercise, we're going to use the chair as the branch that we're bracing. Place it around and now we're going to splice the rope back into, uh, into the rope. What we've done here is we've taken the blowtorch and using the blowtorch, we've applied one of the Cobra end caps to the end of the rope that we're going to splice back into, the, into itself. Okay, and so now we just splice the rope 10 to 12 inches back into itself. And bring it out. There. We then create a small loop and then once again moving two to three inches further along, splice the rope back in. Leaving it in there like that. That gives you a nice tight connection, allows for tree growth and hopefully, when braced at the other end, you'll have a nice, secure brace. Once again, squeeze the rope together and just feed the shock absorber into the rope as such. Easy as that. So taking the Cobra end cap, slide that over the end of the Cobra rope and using the Cobra blowtorch, apply gentle heat to shrink the end cap onto the end of the Cobra rope. And there you have it.